old sculpture in doré bronze, about 130 centimeters high, mounted on a plinth made of a type of marble. The surface of the sculpture was tested with professional reagents for 18k gold, the result was positive, it is gold. The sculpture was created using the lost wax technique, Sir Perdue, in the European workshop, possibly France or Italy, weighing approximately 30 kilograms. It dates roughly from the 30s 40s, but there is a possibility that it is older considering the Egyptomania period of the 1920s 1930s, when there was an explosion in style, architecture and objects created with the imprints of ancient Egypt. The dating was carried out according to the pitch of the thread on which the statuette is attached to the plinth, specific to those years, the patina deposited on the fastening system, the patina of the gold film in which the sculpture is covered, and other elements specific to antiquities. The sculpture has a strong visual impact due to its impressive dimensions, about 130 centimeters high, but also to the details beautifully highlighted by the author. This object is unique and special. About the goddess Serket, women had a crucial role in ancient Egypt, it was known that the deceased, Osiris, could be revitalized slash resuscitated thanks to his wife Isis and sister-in-law Nephthys, thus being able to regain his vital functions, breathing, movement, virility, in afterlife. A major contribution to this passage was made by the goddesses Serket and Nath. Serket, the scorpion goddess, is known in Egyptian mythology as the goddess of fertility, nature, medicine and magic, the one who holds the secrets to all cures, poisons, toxins, potions and antidotes, but not least the goddess who can treat and protect against the stings of venomous creatures, scorpions, snakes, arachnids, Insects. The ancient Egyptians worshipped Serket as she was supposed to be the goddess of poisonous creatures, especially the scorpion. She was depicted as a particularly beautiful woman, with her arms outstretched in a gesture of protection, with a scorpion on her head having an erect tail. Ready to attack, to highlight Serket's role as a protector against venomous stings. Eventually, Serket was absorbed into the cult of Horus where she was closely associated with death and the soul of the deceased, the goddess being known to help the dying adapt to the afterlife, helping and to breathe again in the other realm. The goddess Serket is best known for her statuette discovered at Tutankhamun's tomb in 1922 by Howard Carter alongside the other goddesses, Isis, Nephthys, and Nath. Circuit having the role of protecting the canopic container in which the deceased's viscera were stored after embalming. Considered the patroness of the pharaohs, Circuit also has a double role in Egyptian mythology, namely as the protector of justice, but also the harsh punisher of mistakes, as she is known to protect pregnant mothers and children against the bites of poisonous creatures. In a myth known to Egyptology and transcriptions by Egyptologists, she protected the goddess Isis and her infant son Horus from Seth when they both had to hide in the marshes. Ancient Egyptians believed that by worshipping, offering and praying to the scorpion goddess, they could be saved, protected and treated from venomous stings. The goddess Serket was associated with magic with many magical spells and incantations attesting to her role as the patron saint of practitioners of magical medicine dealing with poisonous stings, cures and fluids, antidotes and toxins, it is known that in ancient Egypt medicine was science and folklore, combined with magic, incantations and magical potions created by the doctors and priests of the time. In fact, Circuit is mentioned in many texts deciphered by Egyptologists, texts related to incantations and spells for the treatment of toxins and poison. Circuit was associated with the Western Cardinal Point, W, this cardinal point being closely related to death and rebirth, Circuit helping the deceased breathe again into the afterlife. In the pain of the scorpion's sting, is the pleasure of another life, Circuit, 